Hi guys, welcome to a box packing with my prototype Juliet. So here she is, I'm just getting her ready now to get ready to go home. It's so bittersweet because I'm gonna miss her so, so much. I am putting her, she's actually going home as a little girl, so I'm putting her in this adorable little bunny sleeper. And it's by Koala Baby, it's zero to three months. I'm so, so excited that she's gonna go home as a baby girl. I think she looks so adorable as one. Oh my goodness, this pink color brings out her coloring so well. So I just filmed this with my regular video camera and I'm filming it um, in the sunshine. It's such a cute little bunny sleeper. Oh, and it's the perfect fit on her as well. <laughs> There's her magnetic pacifier that she's going home with, also a bunny. She's also going home with this hair bow, or actually it's a hair tie, as well as this tie back. And this adorable little dusty rose pillow and the dusty rose cap as well. It's a set and it's a knot hat. She's also going home with this adorable little baby gap romper that I took a video of her in. I think it just suits her coloring so perfectly. And this koala baby receiving blanket that's super cute. And the boy layette that I had, he had adorable little booties. So this little girl is getting some booties as well. And these are for mother care. And this little set by H&M, which is again, another bunny rabbit thumper from Bambi. So I'm gonna move her over to the side while I start to pack her little box. So this is the certificate she's going home with. It's her birth certificate. She is baby 421, number 932 on my certificates, but she's actually the 431st baby I've ever made. And she's going home with this adorable little card and of course some of my business cards. I like to put those at the bottom of the box and then put the certificate in there as well. And then I like to line it with bubble wrap, and this is what I will eventually use to wrap the baby up super snugly. And yes, I have pink bubble wrap. <laughs> and I like to swaddle my baby super well. And I do like to use a diaper over the head to protect the face. And I have these adorable little fabric bags. This one's got little hearts on it, just like my nursery theme um, that I like to put my pacifier and hair clips in. Well, I'm zoomed way in. <laughs> and I am gonna remove her tag from her pajamas and put it in the box as well. I like my clients to know that all the clothes that go home with the baby are brand new. And then I put the diaper over the face and tuck in the little hands. Oh, I'm gonna miss her so much. And then I like to swaddle the baby just like you do a newborn and leave a little bit of the fabric to go over the face as well. Just a little bit of extra protection. This receiving blanket is also from Koala Baby. And then I like to put that right into the bubble wrap and wrap her right up inside that. Now I underestimated how big she was, so I'm gonna need another piece of bubble wrap to go around her bottom half. But then she's nice and bundled up, super secure. And I like to put in the little pacifier bag. And now I wrap. <laughs> So because this one actually shipped to me um, still bundled up, I'm gonna leave it in its baggie, protected, and put in the little booties. Mm -hmm. 
and I like to use colored tissue paper for my gift wrapping. Another one. Ah, oh, this one's so cute because it's got butterflies all over it. And this one, the pillow, oops, and the romper, and the head, the headband, and the tie back. And tuck that right in with baby as well. And now I like to fill out the card for the client who just got her. Um, the nice little message and tuck that in there as well. And what I like to do here is just add a little bit of um, like confetti sparkles to the top. Just a little bit of extra pizzazz, I guess. And four or five diapers for the journey home. And then I like to fold my box up. And I've had a few people ask me about um, why I send my babies home with such brightly colored tape and I do this so that my babies my customers will know if they're especially if I'm shipping worldwide that they'll know the box was opened by customs if so so this is just an extra layer of protection plus it makes the box look all pretty and I have tons of different tape And that's all. So if you guys want more content like this, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye guys. See you next time.